All right, guys. Yeah, this thing is actually pretty cool. It's a water bottle, and uh, it says New Flyer on it. That's pretty cool. I like that a lot. Yeah, that's pretty sick. Yeah, that's pretty cool. It's a water bottle that says New Flyer on it. But you know what? I don't think it's a hot beverage container. I got to read the instructions in there, but it could be a hot beverage container. Okay, next thing I got. This here is a pen, and it says uh, United States Seating. And uh, you guys might know this logo, that little globe logo you might see on some of the seats. And it says the letters US, I mean USSS, I believe it says that with a little globe on it, on their seats. So, but you know, I know that name, United States Seating. So that, that pen's pretty cool. I like that. I'm going to hold on to that. And the cool thing about it, it's got one of those things on the end where you could use it for your phone or whatever. So, like, if I wanted to um, unlock my phone over here, I could use this device for that as well. All right. What else do we get? Um, cool. Look at this. This is a Detroit Diesel was there, and they were showing off their stuff. Um, they had a lot of information on Detroit Diesel and stuff like that, and I was able to talk with the guy. It was pretty cool. He gave me this light. It's a USB light. I actually didn't plug it in yet, but you know what, as a matter of fact, uh, you know what, I'm doing some uploading on my computer, as you can see, well, you see a computer in the background there, so I don't want to unplug it because I'm getting my internet from my phone, which is tethering, so I'll just leave it because that wire kind of sucks, and if it moves a little bit, it'll disconnect, and I'm trying to upload another video for you guys, so that's that. This is cool. I like this a lot. This is one of my favorite ones. I should have got two, but I don't like getting more than one because then I feel like um, everybody's supposed to just take one. So I took one of these MCI Detroit Diesel pens with the thing on the end that you can use for your phone as well. This thing is cool. So I'll be holding on. I'm going to try. I want to write with it, but I'm going to try to hold on to it because that's probably the only one I'm going to ever get. And that blue color is pretty sick. So, whatever. Other you, some of you guys just think, ah, whatever, it's just a pen. But I wanted to save and hold on to it. Alright, this is cool. I wish I grabbed more of these. But I, um, I grabbed one of each. This, the uh, regular 40, 40 foot version and the 60 foot articulated version. And they're little pins that you can put on your shirt or whatever. But they're in a specific theme of the electric bus. The electric Excelsior, New Flyer Excelsior bus. The top one is a 60 foot and the bottom one obviously is the 40 foot. Um, I was thinking about it, that's why I paused there. I was thinking about opening them and showing you guys, but I think I want to keep them in there so that they don't get ever scratched or anything like that because those are pretty cool and I'm not going to wear them around because they're so small and nobody's going to know what I'm talking about or what I, why, why I have those, so I'm just going to hold on to them, you know? Alright, so another thing I got is from NFI Parts and NFI Parts is the part, part supplier for New Flyer and Orion and all the companies that Orion bought out and uh, including MCI now. I don't know if they bought them out or if they merged or what, but NFI part does supply the parts for MCI buses so it's a little thing you put on the back of your phone or whatever so you can put your finger in between it so you can hold it up and like aim it towards you and stuff like that um, I forgot what the specific term is for those things but that's one of those things so I got one of those things and then yeah I got um, a pair of sunglasses that say MCI on the side so um, everybody will think I'm a 1990s phone company when I walk by no, I'm just kidding, because nobody knows, nobody's going to really know what I'm talking about, but that's cool. But on the other side, it actually says Detroit for Detroit Diesel. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, they'll just think I'm talking about like a city or something like that. But you guys know Detroit. So what else we got in here? Oh, another pen. NFI Parts. We were just talking about them. I actually got a pen from them. So I got one pen from NFI Parts and that little phone thing over there. What else we got? Oh, a deck of cards. This one was pretty cool. They had them on display and they showed the cards real quick. So I want to actually 
if you um, at in a second I'll sh I'm gonna open it and show you the jacks and the queens and the kings because they're pretty cool because they show different models of different buses from NFI parts and NFI. You know what would be really cool if this thing had like an Orion Seven or something like that as like a one or something like they should have went a little further, but they went pretty good with it. You know what I mean? So well I'll show you that in a, in a minute because I gotta open it up and gather the ones because some of them are boring and stuff. You just want to see the cool ones so. Um, by the way, the bag I'm pulling this out of, this is the bag they gave me. It says Detroit Diesel and all the sponsors. I'll show you that too at the end. All the people that sponsored it and everything like that. And, um, see, one of these, uh, sorry guys, I took two, but this, these sunglasses, one of them was already in the bag and then I grabbed another one, so I'm sorry about that. Um, I got a lot of like booklets and stuff, which if you stick around to the end, I'll show you the booklets because they're kind of the least cool. But I'll just show you the covers and stuff like that. And if you guys want to see the whole thing, just let me know and I'll just make a video. I got a notepad for the 2018 MCI uh, Reliability Rally, which is pretty cool. Every page says uh, MCI Reliability Driven. And I actually just needed a notepad. I'm going to use both sides of this. Um, and I think that's everything that I got from there. Yeah, these are pretty cool. Especially those little buses, man. These are... I wish I would have got some more. I wonder what other ones... Uh, you know, if anybody else has a different model or something like that, it's not... And you guys didn't really see it so good. Let me see if I can zoom in real quick for you. It says, you know, take charge or something like that, or charge. Let me try to focus real quick. That's as good as it's going to get, guys. You can see that it says charge. And I'm going to look at it myself and tell you what it says above. It's so, like... I couldn't tell you what it says above charge right now, but it does say something above charge. But it's pretty cool. The blue one is cool. That was the same color as the one I actually saw was blue. So stay tuned. I got videos coming up. I got uh, videos of the J3500 and brand new 2019 MCI J4500, a brand new 2018 J4500. A couple of used MCI J4500 videos to show you guys, and I also have the brand new D45 CRT LE video that I'm working on editing right now. That's why I can't disconnect my thing because that's going to be an issue. So, um, real quick before I let you guys go, I want to show you. <clears throat> let me stand up because I was getting out to show you the other stuff. What I got? This is a pre-owned coach. All about their pre-owned coach program. This is the D45 CRTLE, a booklet on that. I'm thinking about making a video on this. If you want to see what's in there and the different features of it, let me know. I'll make a video on that. The J4500 book, which is cool. I, I'm glad to have this stuff. Um, the MCI Advantage Total Cost of Operation. I'm definitely going to be making a video about this video, this booklet right here because there's some pretty cool stuff I wanted to share with you guys in there. Um, if you guys are interested in seeing stuff about MCI, they're actually traveling right now to their different centers. They started in Florida, now they're in Jersey, and they're about to be going to, I believe, Iowa next. So you might want to check MCI.com slash rally, and you'll see all the information on that, where they are. So you can check out their, their different buses they got and stuff like that. And if you want to see the MCI J3500, you're going to definitely see it, and you can definitely ride it too, if you really want to check it out. So this is the J uh, series booklet. So you got the J4500 booklet and then you got another booklet for the J series J4500 but it also includes the J3500. So I assume maybe this is the new version of the other booklet. We saw that. Um, this is a book about livery and just like a little, actually this is just an advertisement um, type of pamphlet. So, so that's what that is right there. Um, Another am uh, advertisement. Oh, no, that's pretty cool. That's just like a D series little thing. Man, I wonder who took these pictures. That's pretty cool. Those are good pictures. Um, and a 2018 calendar. If you guys want to see every page of that, just let me know in the comments and I'll make a video of it because I have it. I'm not going to write on it or anything or use it. I think I got two of those. One of them I got inside the bus, and then one of them I got inside MCI itself. So, <clears throat> there's that. And somehow I got two of these as well. I don't know how that happened. 
So here's another just advertisement on the J4500 that it could take on mountains. It could go all the way to the top of any mountain in the United States on a dirt road. And then just information, stuff like that. Information. They're going to be coming out with a J3500. I believe. Well, not J3500, but they're, in general they're going to be coming out with a coach that's going to be all battery powered. So... You guys might want to stay tuned for that. Anyway, that was that's it. That's everything I got. And I got some videos from this company, Valer, which is pretty like Marco Polo buses that they rebranded. That's maybe we'll start seeing them come to the United States. I got a couple pictures and videos of them. I'm not too crazy about them, but they do look pretty cool. And if they're at the right price, I could see companies using them. Like uh, in North Jersey, they use those weird looking buses and stuff that kind of look like these and you'll see the video when I put it out I got so much stuff to edit so stay tuned don't forget to like comment and subscribe and if you're not um, clicking that bell just click that bell because I got a lot of new stuff coming up especially the buses that I just saw today I mean the J35 ain't nothing wait till you see some of the old buses I saw I saw some old like I don't really know because I didn't see the VIN number plate but you'll see alright guys talk to you later